All right, we have filed IFR and uh, with the possibility of canceling it right before we get into Lakeland, I'm gonna leave that up to my uh, trusty co-pilot, <laughs> take the nav, and uh, we're gonna give her hell, man. Son of fun, 2021, starting a little wet, <laughs> but hopefully it ends dry. See you in the cockpit. Okay, if we were gonna go to Sun and Fun, the plane had to be clean. So before we left a couple days, we got the pressure washer out and got 383 Julia Tangle all cleaned up, ready for her flight to Lakeland. Didn't realize it was gonna be raining when we left. But we'll get to that later. Okay, Sun and Fun update. <laughs> We think we're gonna go file IFR. We got the plane ready. We got the cameras on. We're all packed and ready to go. So now, it's just a matter of getting out. Here's what we see so far. Kinda scuzzy. And we're hearing a little bit of thunder in the background. This front is literally right north of Sanford, just a few miles north of us. So it is it is staying there. It is stabilizing. So we'll, we'll see what happens. But uh, Bert and I are going to file an IFR plan and then hopefully cancel it, go VFR by the time we hit Lake Parker. But Good news is we've got everything pretty much ready to go. I, I, I repositioned the camera this time directly down the nose of the plane. So hopefully we get some good shots going into sun and fun, hopefully. Okay, so here's the approach to Lake Parker from the east. And it was fairly easy to find once we got below the clouds. It's fairly good sized lake. Of course, when you start flying over Lake Parker, it's easy to see on the right-hand side there, the power plant. So we caught that almost immediately. About midway through the lake, that's when we were spotted. And we were asked to give a wing rock. That's coming up. And then as soon as we did the wing rock, uh, they asked us to go nose to tail in line right along Interstate 4, which is right up there in front of us. So this all happens real quick. You can see here, here's the Lake Parker arrival. And the arrival asks that we go to I-4. You can see that two-lane highway right there. Right on uh, the left side of the cowling. And so we're gonna follow that on down. Well, when you go nose to tail, you're in a Cirrus with a Cessna in front of you. We came up on him pretty darn quick. So at this point, it was a flaps dump, cut the engine back, and we tried to maintain our distance behind him. And there he is, you can see him right down there. We were, we were slightly high here, but that was on purpose because I needed to maintain some elevation to keep our speed up. So now we're heading toward the cake tower and the white ball. They're coming up here in just a minute. Okay, you might be asking why the voiceover? Well, I had another audio problem, which is probably just as well because this was a really busy cockpit. There wasn't a lot of verbal communication, more of a lot of listening for direction. This approach is 100% listening and there's no return communications from, from any aircraft. So you just had to listen really well.
Okay, if you look on either side of the cowling there, you can see the cake tower on the left and the white ball on the right. You just go right between those. And that lines you up directly with the next point, which is that V-shaped building. And that'll be coming up in just a minute. I left this part in real time so you can see just how quickly this happens when you pass the cake tower and the white ball. We are moving along at a pretty good clip, probably about 100 knots. And you can see right in front of us, that is the show area uh, that we're approaching there, right, right just above the cowling. Coming up here in a minute, you're going to see that Cessna again. It'll come into view. I'll put a circle around it. And you're going to see just how closely we followed him and then landed in. And I'm sure those of you who have been to Sun and Fun before know what I'm talking about. This is where it gets kind of interesting. And here's that V-shaped building coming into view on the left. At this point, you can hear Fern becoming the flight instructor again. So he's making sure that I'm not getting too slow. Um, I'm looking at my airspeed the whole time um, because I had been from the white ball and the cake tower. But here's where it gets fun. Five-year plan. 